In this tutorial, I will be using mod API to one shot kill enemies and to not die. The most common questions I get are, can you do this in creative mode? Yes, you can. You can do this in any mode that you want to do it in. Can you do this in multiplayer? Yes, you can. How do you make your screen so bright? Well, in the in-game settings, in the graphics tab, I go over to color grading and I select M131. I then hit Alt F3 to open up my NVIDIA filters and I choose the brightness slash contrast setting. In there, I turn the contrast to negative 100% and I turn the shadows down to negative 100%. Another question I get, why can't I pick up or find the item? Well, if you're on console, the PC is different. For example, on the PC, I can go to the yacht or I can go to the hanging cave to get the cassette player. On the console, you can only go to the yacht. Another very common question I get, why won't the cave cross off? There are three possible reasons for this. The first one, it could be a glitch. Save the game, quit the game. If you're on PC, verify the cache, load the game back up, and then very quickly go in and out of each entrance to the cave. If that does not work, you probably missed something, which is number two. You'll have to just rewatch the video Try and retrace your steps, figure out what you did wrong. Number three, you probably didn't explore the connected cave first. For example, I tried to explore baby cave while I was playing the forest one time. And while I did that, it didn't cross off. I had to explore hanging cave first, get that crossed off, and then go into the baby cave, which is keep exploring hanging cave, by the way. That's, what we're, that's the one I'm talking about. I had to then go back into that cave and then I could cross it off. I don't know if that's just something they knew that they threw in or what. Maybe it's a glitch, I don't know. But I'm just letting you know that there is a possibility that it is there. Cave number one, dead cave. There are two entrances total to this cave. This is also where they are located on the map. So pause the video and head to whichever one you wanna to go to. The most important item in this cave is the katana. The other items you can find in this cave are as followed. Cassette tape 5, Timmy's toy torso, a crucifix, a sketch Latin paper, Timmy's drawings 1, 2, and 3. You can pick up all three of them, but when you open up your inventory, it will only show two. Not sure what that's about, so don't even bother asking. There are 10 passengers inside this cave. The passengers are as followed. 2B, 3B, 3A, 1A, 8A, 5C, 1D, 2A, 1B, 1C. I highly recommend watching these videos in order. In the top right corner, you can click on the playlist to open it right now. I highly recommend doing it if you're trying to get all the caves explored. And with all that out of the way, let's head right on into this cave. Heading on down into the cave, I'm going to push E to let go of the rope. Because I have God Mode on and I can just land on the ground right here. There we go. Okay, we will be entering each cave from the entrance that's closest to the main item. For example, we're in the Katana cave right now. So we use this entrance here to get to the Katana faster. That's the only reason I entered this one. Okay, so let us continue exploring the dead cave. Here we go. Got some cloth right here. Okay. We got Timmy's toy torso right there on the ground right there. We have one picture right here. We have another picture right here. There we go. All righty. Heading on up this rope. I could use the fly mode, but I'm not going to do that because in the cave, it gets a little bit glitchy and weird and I don't want to deal with that stuff. Okay. An armsy over there. We're going to go left here first. Okay. There's a suitcase right there with clothing if you want to get it gonna go this way down here mm-hmm mm -hmm. let me get out my bow just because just because okay heading on into this little area right here we're gonna crouch all right there's some cloth right there if you want to break that open and get it and then we have some passengers let me get the passenger manifesto we have some passengers okay so there's 3b 3a Okay, and 1A and 8A. I assume this guy is 8A. I have no idea, but there you go. Okay, there's some passengers. I don't know why, uh, I don't know why that happened. Anyway, so there's 
four. One, two, three, four. Yep, there's four. Okay. We have the Smexy Katana right here. Let me just equip this real quick to number one. I'm going to put this at to number three. And there we go. Katana. Noise. All right, let's continue on this way a little bit. There's some soda pop if you want to get it. Behind this wall is a... Is a... Uh, that's the wrong button. Get the heck out of here, command console. Thank you. Okay. There's a flashlight. All right. You can break this open if you want to. There's nothing behind it but the flashlight. A little bit of booze right there, but you can't touch nothing else in here. So you can break it if you want to. You don't have to. All right. Moving right along. We're going to go back up this way. You can break this open, like I said. There's some cloth right there. All right. Heading on back up. Okay. I like caves. They're so... They're very interesting, but also very deadly at the same time. Okay. I'm going to hop up this little piece right here. Just to get over. This way faster. I'm going to hit this armsy. He'll die in one shot. Because I have mods. That's why he died in one shot. You will not get that. There should be some cannibals that spawn in. If not, I'm going to be a little freaked out by that. Okay, here's another passenger. 2B. All right. I hear breathing. Okay, there's five passengers now. All right. I hear breathing. There we go. One dead. Two dead. Okay. All right, that's it for that area. We're going to head up this way now. Uh, you good, sir? All right, well, there's, there's that. <laughs> Let's just head on over this way. Hopefully, it's not that bad as I go over here more. Okay. You want to get to this area right here with all this gunk on the floor and go to the right. You want to come and see here. You want to break open these cases. Okay. My sound is messed up because of that stupid freaking body. Rip. Uh, just head on over here. There we go. This area counts towards the dead cave, so you want to head on into that cubby hole and make sure you do it, okay? All right, heading back up this way. Okay. We can just head on up this way. Got some sticks on the ground. I'm going to pick these up just in case I need them for a torch or something. There we go. Heading on into here. Stupid freaking thing. There we go. Okay. And then just go in the water. Up out of the water. And then there's another passenger right here. We're going to pull out a passenger manifest. All right. There is six now. Okay. Now we're going to head to the left away from that passenger over here. I'm going to break this open. There we go. On the ground, you will see a picture. There we go. That's all three pictures now. And then, there we go. To-do list update. I'm going to just leave the cave because there's um, passengers out here too that you got to get. Okay. Passenger manifest. All right. There are five passengers out here, but it'll only count four of them. So we're going to head straight first. Okay. To this guy. This guy doesn't count as a passenger, apparently. Okay. And then to the left, there'll be two more. Seven and eight. There we go. You got one B, one C. And then heading back to this guy and going left, you'll see this guy standing here. Or not standing, but whatever. There's nine, passenger one D. And then right here is passenger two A. That's all ten right there. Okay. This guy, for whatever reason, doesn't count as a passenger. I don't, I don't know why. All right. Heading on back into the cave. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, getting our katana back out. Hell yeah. Gonna just crouch around here and break that. Thank you. All right, we're gonna head left towards this body now. There's some pop on the floor if you want to get it. And then we're heading down this little, I don't know, fun time, epic cave little thing. I don't, I don't know. We're heading down this way. I just go down. Okay. I'm gonna crouch down here. There's some suitcases if you want to get them. I'm not gonna get them. There's some pop right there too. Alright. Lots of pop in this cave. 
Okay, and I'm gonna head left into this cubby hole. Once you see that skull floating right there, head left. Okay. Down this little cubby hole. Just be careful you don't run past the cassette tape right here. Here we go. Or the yeah, the cassette tape. Cassette tape number five. Heading straight down again. We're going to pick up this picture. Okay. Thank you very much. Some dynamite. We're going to head out this cubby hole here. Because there's more dynamite that we're going to need. All right. So we're going to get all the dynamite right now. There we go. All the dynamite. This is what it looks like out here. If you want to see, there you go. The hole in that wall over there, but whatever. Moving back in. Gonna get out our handy dandy flashlight. There we go. Katana. Here we go. I'm gonna pick up these skulls. We're gonna need them later. Alrighty, alrighty. Bum, 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 bum. Heading on back up to the little cubby hole entrance here. Okay. We're gonna head left towards the skull now. I'm gonna break this open. Oh, there's a crucifix on the floor. Make sure you pick that up. Here we go. Put the katana back out. Oh, dang it. Break this open. Thank you very much, sir. Go and break this open. There we go. Heading on out over here. And to-do list updated. There we go. Explore dead cave. Dead cave is now done. All right, see. So that was the dead cave. That is it for the dead cave. I'm not going to kill that armsy, even though he really wants to say hello. Hello, sir. And there we go. That is it for this cave. Okay. Okay. All right. Yes, I'm excited too. Okay. All right. Let's just head back this way. So that's it for the dead cave. Um, I don't think the other entrance counts as the dead cave because it gets explored here. So I'm wondering what that other entrance is now because I might have messed up. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Click on the video on the left to go to cave two, which is the hanging cave. Click the playlist on the right. If you need to get the entire Spelunker achievement, I walk you through the entire thing. All right. Or even the passengers. I do that too. All right. Click on any one of those videos. And I hope you enjoyed this one.